wonderful job on the uh, graphics for the new brochures. Have you seen them? Not yet. I'd like to. Well, join me in my suite later. And, uh, we'll go over them and see which ones we want to use. Okay, you're on. My date for tonight caught a sudden cold when she found out where I was taking her. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah. Now, I don't suppose you'd be interested in a Warriors basketball game. Oh, that's very kind of you, Peter, but I'm going to send down for some cold poached salmon and curl up with a good mystery. Okay. <laughs> Actually, I'm a Warrior fan. I'd love to go to a game, just some other night. <laughs> Mrs. Cabot, who are you and how did you get in here? My brother-in-law is very handy. It only took him two days to make a key for your private elevator and then disconnect your alarm systems. What about the guy, Ma? What are we going to do with him? Edgar, who is he? My name is McDermott. I'm the general manager of this hotel, and I'd suggest... No, no. Don't suggest anything, mister. Just keep still. What do you want? Justice, Mrs. Cabot. Real justice. You're going to stand trial here. I'm accusing you of murder. Center the table. Uh, get that chair for the witness. Uh, Mrs. Cabot, I think you'd better phone downstairs and uh, tell them you do not wish to be disturbed. Move! Go on! Evelyn, it's Mrs. Cabot. Uh, Mr. McDermott and I are in a meeting. Please, no interruptions until I call you. Thank you. What are you doing? That's not an ashtray. Sit down! Please. What are we going to do about him, Ma? This isn't how we practiced it. Hey, Brenda, will you stop worrying? McDermott there is going to stay out of things, aren't you? No. If we're really going to have a trial, I'm going to defend Mrs. Cabot. No, you're not. You're going to sit down there and you're going to keep your mouth shut. Luther, it's all right. Everyone. Everyone is entitled to a defense. Even the guilty. Defense of what? I don't know who you are or why you've accused me of anything. The truth will out. Edgar. You're the judge. Take your place. You'll never get away with this. There's no way to get out of the hotel. <laughs> hey, judge, tell this uh, counselor he's out of order. That candid makes you feel like a man, does it? You want to know how much of a man I feel like? Let's see how much of a man you are. All huh? right, all right. Look, Luther. Did you hear what Luther, he said to me, Ma? Luther, Come on. get back there. Come on. <sighs> Mr. McDermott, don't be a hero. Don't even try. I'm afraid I didn't do a very good job of raising that one. He's got a very bad temper. Sometimes I think he enjoys hurting people. Don't give him any reason to hurt you. May I have a Bible? What? Mrs. Cabot, you do have a Bible, don't you? It's in my desk. Case of the Ellsworth family versus Victoria Cabot. 